एस चांद प्रेजेंट्स एजुकेशनल वीडियो लेक्चर्स एस पर दी ए आई सी टी ई कारिकुलम डिफिकल्ट कॉन्सेप्ट मेड इजी स्टडी एनी वेयर एनी टाइम we are learning the basics of casting process and in this basic casting processes uh, we will be learning about the fettling process today in this part of the video uh, the fettling process which is majorly removal of the extra material from the surface of the casted item polishing the surface of the casted item or cleaning the surface of casted item comes in this category and this is the second part of the video if you haven't seen the first part of the video you can click the link which is there in the description box welcome to s chand academy and i am anmol bhatia for detailed conceptual clarity you can refer to the book by s chand publishing the link of the book is there in the description box below so this is the second part of the video basic metal casting processes and in this part of the video we will cover the fettling process so the basic casting processes or the steps in the basic casting process are as follows which are making a pattern molding uh, or the process of molding or mold making melting the metal pouring into the mold waiting for its solidification and removing the casting is already covered in the previous videos now in this part of the video we will cover the fettling process the heat treatment and the testing inspection process so what is this fettling process in casting fettling is basically an operation of cutting the unwanted parts cleaning and finishing of the final casting so here in the fettling process we will remove the unwanted parts or we will clean the final parts which are being produced or we will finish the parts which are there in the final product so for fettling operation or for fettling process we have these three operations which are to be performed number 1 is the rough cleaning operation number 2 is the surface cleaning operation and number 3 is the finishing operation so what is this rough cleaning operation and how can we remove the material from the surface that is to be illustrated in this rough cleaning uh, process of fettling so in rough cleaning process majorly what we will do we will cut the metal which is extra from the surface of the casted item if that material is a ductile material then we will go for the cutting process we will we can cut that material with the help of saw uh, majorly in this ductile material case if it is a brittle material so we can break that extra material that can be possibly uh, be done with the help of this breaking process but if it is steel the casted material is steel then we can go for the cutting of the material with the help of a cutting torch cutting torch majorly has uh, a flame which is acetylene and oxygen flame combination and with the help of that flame we can cut the material for the extra growths or extra projections which are there on the surface of the cast then we have the finishing process finishing is the ultimate last process of the fettling uh, in which what happens we majorly make use of machining process in the machining process we can make use of lathe machine or a shaper machine or a planer machine in order to remove the debris from the surface or we can opt for the chemical treatments or the polishing processes or the buffing process and ultimately the painting process of the casted casted items then comes the surface cleaning part surface cleaning uh, is basically uh, done to clean the interior or the exterior surfaces when the sand or other adhering materials are involved in that casted item then we can go for uh, the surface cleaning aspect so surface cleaning is nothing but cleaning of 
the interior or the exterior surfaces which are in contact with the sand or other adhering items which are there over the final casted product. So, so far we covered this fettling process in which I have told you that we can have the rough cutting operation or we can have the finishing operation or the surface finishing operation. Now the, the things which are ultimately left in the final casting process or the steps is the heat treatment process. So we have several uh, heat treatment processes which are used to increase the properties of the uh, material. Let's say we want to harden the material, we have the process of hardening or tempering or quenching process or normalizing. So we have several heat treatment processes that can be uh, done on the final part that is being produced in order to enhance its properties. Now the next, next thing comes is the testing and inspection of the casting. So what happens in some of the situations we have uh, to test the casting for the final uh, output or the final outcome which is being produced by these steps. So in order to test the casting we have certain processes which are namely the destructive processes in which we break the casting and check whether uh, the internal structure is uh, having what kind of grains or we also check the microstructure and we detect the tensile strength and other stuff and additionally we have the non-destructive testings in which we have the ultrasonic testing in which we have to test the internal structures with the help of ultrasonic techniques and uh, if the casting is faulty then it can be detected with the help of that non-destructive techniques. So in order to have the final um, casting that is to be handed over to the customer, uh, the final casting has to be checked, tested and inspected in order to obtain the desired properties. So these castings should have the desired properties inside so that this can be obtained. So with this we covered the two processes which are fettling and the heat treatment inspection process of the casting. With this we come to the end of the second part of the video which is basics of casting processes in which we learnt the fettling process, the heat treatment processes and also the process to test and inspect the final product which is prepared after solidification. For detailed conceptual clarity you can refer to the book by S. Chand Publishing the link of the book is there in the description box below. If you find the video interesting, like, share, subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for future updates. Thank you. All rights reserved. This video has been prepared for educational purposes only. No part of it may be reproduced or copied without the permission of the copyright holder.